<laughs> but that said, I have a daughter who wants to get into acting. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Um, there's a term that is thrown around these days, and it is Nepo baby. We've all heard mm -hmm, it. It's sort mm -hmm. of like a hot term that people say. Mm -hmm. I am, I, as a parent, am so concerned that no one will be able to say to my daughter, you're a Nepo baby. You're a Nepo baby. That's how you, that's why you're acting, because your father's an actor and your mother's an actor. And the equivalent would be, of this situation, mm -hmm. my 15 year old daughter would sit up here on the talk with us. Mm -hmm. Now, uh, I'm, I'm just saying that's the equivalent is I would be saying, oh, you can come, you can come work with me. Mm -hmm. I don't think my, I don't think that's the best for my daughter. My daughter needs to go through what her mother and I went through, which is, <laughs> which is, a tremendous amount of rejection, a tremendous mm -hmm. amount of failure, and every time you fail and every time you are rejected, you become stronger, you become better, and it becomes part of your journey, yeah. and it becomes something you are proud of. Now that said, I don't know much about the NBA, I don't watch a lot of NBA, I'm not sure that Bronny, historical moment last night, went through all those trials and 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 rejection and all that stuff that other players in the NBA have gone through. Okay, all right, and I'm just gonna point out, he's making what, like almost eight million dollars. You well, know, I, I, money is out. money is. I, 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 I'm not here to talk about money. Like, yeah, well, don't, I'm here don't to talk about, about money. Yeah, that, if that, my child would make an eight million dollars. That, that's a million dollars. Baby play. <laughs> WNBA players will never First see. Off, but go ahead, Akbar. You know, I think it's it's interesting that so many people are trying to hold LeBron James accountable for this nepotism or nepo baby in in Bronny James. But that same thing in that same type of heat is not being brought upon the owner for the Los Angeles Lakers, Jeannie Talk Buss. About it. She inherited that from her father. You think about yeah, football. Historically, you think about historically, like yeah. the Steelers, the Rooney family. You think about the Giants, Mara. Like all these other kids are inheriting their family's business. So for LeBron and Bronny, yeah. I look at last night as, yes, you know, I, I think you, what you're saying is true. I don't disagree with you. But I also think, too, that you can't necessarily, you know, deny the access that you have. You know, like LeBron has Mac, I mean, like crazy influence. Like, yeah, if you can utilize that influence to give your son that opportunity, then yeah. why not use it? There, like, I, Akbar, I do think, I do think, using the using the genie bus and Mr. and Dr. Bus yeah. analogy, uh, there's a difference. This is athletic ability that we're yeah. talking yeah. about yeah. here. So it's not. Does he, he quite have that talent to be on that? Does, I, believe, on that bench. I, I believe he does have the athletic talent, and okay. I think that's okay. why it shows. Sure. They gave him two minutes, and some would say, "Well, how would you give this, you know, second rounder?" the opportunity to get two minutes a game. Yes, yeah. the moment was there, it's clear. Like, we can't deny it. That is obvious that he got right. that because they wanted that special moment. Right. But the other part is it's an investment. There's so many uh, examples of where you see young athletes mm -hmm. getting into a game early in their career so teams can get an early assessment, see how they handle the pressure, and see if they're ready. That's normal.